Hello everyone, welcome back to Agriculture Insight. Modern technology has changed the entire agricultural landscape of the United States. Even the harvesting and processing of fodder crops for animal feed is done by machines. In the United States, 8.2 million acres are used to grow fodder crops, including alfalfa and corn. With such an enormous area dedicated to fodder crops, it's fascinating to see how advanced machinery and innovative techniques play a crucial role in transforming these plants into essential resources for livestock. Join us as we explore the vast fields where these crops are harvested using cutting-edge technology and follow the journey through meticulous silage and processing techniques that turn them into nutrient-rich feed ready to support the livestock industry. Let's get started. Alfalfa is known as the queen of grasses due to its outstanding nutritional content, especially protein and fiber, which are essential for livestock. Alfalfa is usually harvested three to four times a year when the plant is in the pre-flowering stage, because this is when the protein content is highest. The process of harvesting alfalfa is fast and efficient, thanks to advanced machines that not only cut the crop, but also integrate a suction system to collect and transfer fresh alfalfa directly into attached storage bins. Once harvested, the fresh alfalfa is immediately transported to the livestock area, where it is fed directly to the animals without any additional processing steps. This method not only saves time but also provides a high-protein, fiber-rich feed that promotes livestock health and boosts productivity. It's an effective solution for large-scale farms that need a reliable supply of fresh feed every day. In addition to harvesting alfalfa for fresh feed, it is also collected for silage production. This process perfectly showcases the seamless integration of advanced technology and large-scale agriculture. Specialized mowing machines are deployed across the fields, cutting lush alfalfa stems cleanly and arranging them into uniform rows. With fully automated operation, these machines ensure that every row is cut precisely and evenly, laying the groundwork for the next steps in the collection process. On fields where small rows of alfalfa have already been formed, high-tech forage gathering machines move along the rows, combining multiple smaller rows into larger, more compact ones. This process not only optimizes field space, but also makes the collection faster and more efficient. These modern gathering machines are designed to operate smoothly across vast fields, ensuring the forage is tightly packed, retaining its freshness and nutritional value. Next, Specialized suction and processing machines take over the final stage of handling. These machines use powerful suction to collect all the forage from the large rows, simultaneously shredding it on site. The processed forage is then transferred via an automatic conveyor system and loaded directly into large storage bins attached to trucks. These trucks continuously transport the shredded forage to designated silage sites where it is stored and preserved for livestock feeding. This fully automated process not only ensures high efficiency, but also maintains the quality of the alfalfa, providing a nutrient-rich feed source for large-scale farms across the United States. Every step in the operation is carefully optimized to deliver precision, speed, and sustainability, supporting the needs of modern agriculture. The massive piles of alfalfa silage gathered from trucks are concentrated in designated silage areas with leveled surfaces and proper drainage systems. Once the alfalfa is collected into large piles, farmers use heavy roller tractors or specialized machinery to compress each layer tightly. This compaction process removes any air pockets between the layers, reducing the risk of spoilage during fermentation. Afterward, the piles are sealed with specialized plastic coverings which are secured with sandbags or heavy weights to ensure an airtight seal. This step prevents air from entering and creates an ideal anaerobic environment, allowing natural lactic acid bacteria to ferment the forage effectively. As a result, the silage retains its nutritional quality and can be preserved for extended periods without spoiling. When it's time to use the silage, 
Farmers utilize specialized cutting machines to slice off layers of silage into manageable blocks, or they use suction equipment to extract just the right amount needed. The silage is then transferred to an automated feed mixer, where it's blended with other nutritional ingredients, such as grains or minerals, to create a well-balanced feed ration for the livestock. Once mixed, this nutrient-rich feed is delivered directly to the feeding troughs in the farm, ensuring the cattle receive a wholesome and optimized diet. Silage made from alfalfa is a high-protein, energy-rich feed that is highly beneficial for livestock, especially dairy and beef cattle. In addition to gathering alfalfa into large piles, American farmers also use the technique of compressing forage into large bales and sealing them with specialized polyethylene wrap for silage preservation. After the forage is harvested and chopped, modern baling machines gather it from the field, compress it tightly, and form uniform bales. These bales are then immediately wrapped in multiple layers of plastic film. This wrap is not only waterproof and airtight, but also durable enough to protect the bales during transportation or outdoor storage. This method is highly effective, especially for farms that need to transport forage over long distances. After four weeks of fermentation, the forage inside the bales becomes soft, retains its full nutritional value, and develops a mild, tangy aroma that livestock find highly appealing. On farms, farmers use specialized bale cutting machines to remove the plastic wrap, shred the forage, and put it into the mixer. Then the mixer will mix the alfalfa with nutrients, and then pour it directly into the feed trough for livestock. At some other farms, this feeding process is entirely automated, with high-tech machinery handling every step efficiently and seamlessly. The overhead conveyor feeding system for dairy cows is a modern technology that optimizes the distribution of feed quickly and accurately, is pre-prepared at a central processing area and loaded onto the conveyor through an automatic feeding system. The conveyor moves along the corridor above the cow stalls, stopping at each section to release a precisely measured amount of feed into the feeding trough in front of each cow. In addition to alfalfa, corn silage is also an excellent choice for livestock. The process of harvesting corn for silage in the United States is a precise operation aimed at maximizing its nutritional value for livestock. Farmers harvest corn at the ideal stage, typically when the kernels are in the dough stage and the moisture content is around 65%. Forage harvesters are used to chop the entire corn plant into small uniform pieces Corn silage is incredibly popular among American dairy and beef farmers due to its high energy content, affordability, and ability to provide consistent feed throughout the year. Its versatility and efficient storage methods make it a cornerstone of animal agriculture, particularly in states like Wisconsin, Iowa, and California. As a reliable feed source, corn silage supports the large-scale production of milk and meat that drives the U.S. agricultural economy. Its widespread use highlights the importance of advanced farming techniques and efficient feed management in modern American agriculture. The cost of forage harvesters used for harvesting corn silage can vary significantly depending on the brand, size, and features of the machine. Entry-level models, typically suited for smaller farms, can start at around $100,000 to $150,000, offering basic chopping and loading capabilities. Many farmers offset these costs by leasing equipment or opting for used machines, which can be a more affordable alternative without compromising performance.
Similar to alfalfa, corn is finely chopped directly in the field and then transported to designated storage areas for silage production. At these sites, the chopped corn is piled into large heaps on flat, concrete surfaces. As each layer of chopped corn is added to the pile, heavy roller-equipped tractors move back and forth to tightly compact the material. This compaction process is critical as it removes all air pockets within the corn pile, creating the ideal anaerobic environment for lactic acid bacteria to thrive. Once the corn pile reaches the desired size, the entire surface is sealed with specialized plastic sheeting. This cover is securely held in place with sandbags or other heavy weights to prevent air and water from entering. The silage fermentation process typically lasts four to six weeks, during which lactic acid bacteria lower the pH of the corn, preserving the material for an extended period without compromising its nutritional value. When needed, farmers use automatic silage cutters and mixers to feed livestock without the need for human labor. The machine uses powerful blades to cut through the compacted silage ensuring even extraction of feed material without disrupting the storage structure. The mixer has a rotating blade unit that rotates continuously to ensure the feed is evenly mixed. Some advanced models also allow for the addition of supplements during the mixing process, ensuring precise nutrition for livestock. After mixing, the silage is dispensed directly into the livestock feed trough, saving time and effort while maintaining feed quality. Corn silage provides a high energy feed thanks to the starch content in the kernels, while also supplying fiber from the stalks and leaves, promoting better digestion for livestock. This silage preservation method offers a long-term storage solution, especially useful during winter or when fresh feed becomes scarce. It ensures a steady feed supply, supporting the stability of livestock farming and significantly boosting meat and milk production. So that's where the journey of alfalfa and corn ends here. Are you amazed by modern agricultural technology? If you have any questions or thoughts, feel free to share them in the comments below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay with us to uncover more fascinating stories about modern agriculture. See you in the next video.